A determination to ensure space for the ancient Hindu tradition in the new society of Trinidad and Tobago. And today, firmly rooted with a strong external presence and a continuous internal vigor, maintaining its source of authority and responding to every challenge. A tradition that enriches our diversity through rituals, festivals and philosophy, the Hindu way of life. The Gita is one of the most widely studied texts of Hinduism. Brahmachari Prem Chaitanya of the Chinmaya Mission explains the essential message of this holy scripture. Gita has a very profound message for the upliftment of humanity. In Hinduism, there's a wonderful idea which says that the world is actually a reflection of what is in our mind. And so if we correct our mind, if we make our mind beautiful, we'll see the world as beautiful. The mind is, as it were, the goggles which the eyes wear. And so if the mind is beautiful, the world will appear beautiful. And the Gita centers in exactly on that mind, trying to make that mind beautiful, trying to chasten that mind, trying to purify that mind, trying to make the mind enlightened. And so the individual will see beauty, the individual will see uh, love, compassion everywhere, the individual will see this wonderful creation of God. It does that, the Gita does that by actually delving into what is moral and ethical and what is the nature and characteristic of the universe. In other words, it talks first about the moral ethical realm and then about the metaphysical realm and connects both of them with a word called dharma. And so, if we follow dharma properly, we'll be actually satisfying the moral and ethical requirements placed on human beings. And eventually, that will lead us to the dharma of the universe. The dharma of the universe is God. Shri Bhagavan Vacha Ashochyanan Vashochastvam Pragnyavadanscha Bhashase